Well, it's called the Teal Woman Celebration. Teal being the color for ovarian cancer awareness. And we are in Ovarian Cancer Awareness Month. Women with this type of cancer often say that they feel like a speck of teal in a sea of pink because so little attention is paid to this disease. But the Clarity Foundation is working to change, it, change that. Joining me now, Christina Grint, uh, event chair for the Teal Woman Celebration and cancer survivor, Annette McElhenney. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having, having us. us. So I, I think a lot of people don't understand or don't realize that ovarian cancer is, is the leading deadly women's cancer. So talk a little bit about your story and, and your recovery and of course how the foundation helped you. Okay, I'm an 11 year cancer survivor of ovarian cancer 3C, which is considered advanced. Um, I learned about the foundation in 2009. I was diagnosed in 2008. I knew that Dr. Laura Shaw, was also an ovarian cancer survivor, had started this foundation. Mm -hmm. So I had my profile checked in 2010. Just recently, I've moved from Denver, Colorado, to California permanently, in part for my husband's health, but in part because I want to be close to the cancer, to the Clarity Foundation, in case I recur. I wear these silly beads and all this teal stuff every, every event and also every September, which you said is Ovarian mm -hmm. Cancer Month, to celebrate not only my 11 years in remission, but also to make people aware of those of us in that sea of pink. Right. <laughs> I'd like to just share a few thoughts about ovarian cancer in general. It's the fifth cause of death in women with cancer. Approximately 23,000 people are diagnosed every year and approximately 14,000 die. Uh, most people are diagnosed at stage three, which is advanced cancer because there is no real screening test that's good. Uh, it's not caught on a pap smear, so it often goes to advanced stages before you catch it. Mm -hmm. Most women respond to chemo but a lot of women recur, unfortunately most. Um, <clears throat> talking about reoccurrence, that's where the Clarity Foundation comes in. Uh, Clarity Foundation has for a number of years, since 2008, been, been doing molecular profiles on the tumors of women who have cancer. And as a result of that, they've just added a new program that covers the emotional and psychological with their STEPS program. And all of these services are free, so of course yes. that's why this fundraiser Absolutely. is so important. We're gonna put the information on, your, on our screen and also talk a little bit about right. this uh, particular event. That's right, we're having uh, the Teal Woman event on uh, Sunday. It's at the Kona Kai uh, Hotel and Resort, um, Shelter Island. It's an absolutely wonderful um, evening, a gala evening where we have a, a auction uh, drawing we have Kelly Corrigan who is a New York Times best-selling author right sounds like a great event and you can find out more on that uh, that uh, web address we just gave you thanks for watching we'll see you back here